We're back. And the struggle continues. And hopefully it comes to an end, but we can only be optimistic in these trying times. I have the most flasks I can possibly have. They're the most upgraded they can possibly be. I even have a talisman helping with their effectiveness, although I really don't think it's doing very much. Um, got Mimic Tear, and yeah. Let me start on the Physic Flask, so, whoop, got off center there. Let's start on the Physic Flask. Just try more attempts. The key to success here is with Elden Beast, we need to do a better job at dodging those sword swings with the arc projectile. That's the only hope we have. But at least Radagon has become not intimidating, at least. Took a little too long to do that. Yep, okay. He hit me on the backswing. Oh, shit. I hate that move so much. He's dead, Mimic. <laughs> that didn't go quite as well as usual, I, I don't think, but... Right. Yeah, Mimic has about the usual health. Why did I get off the horse? That's not good RNG. Okay. It's hard to tell where that sword swing is going. Oh! Okay. Oh, this the L2 and R2 the damage is so much better. I hate this attack so much. Oh crap, alright. Are you doing the ring attack? No, you're doing that, okay. Get away from that. A flask. Okay, now he's doing this. Alright. Oh, wait, he didn't follow it up with the swings like he normally does. Those are all going after Mimic. He's being a real trooper. Uh oh. I'm in not a good spot for this. Oh dear. Okay. It worked out. Get up, please. Oh. 
Oh, what the hell was that? God, all right. No, 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 no. Stop hitting me. Stop it. Stop hitting me. Okay. Okay, damage is- oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Okay. The enemy tier is still up. I got a flask, so. Okay, he's doing he's doing it. Alright. Oh! Okay, he's getting mimic with it. Alright. He's all the way over there. Oh, we're getting fantastic RNG. He's not even doing the sword swings. Okay. Hang in there, Mimic. You're doing such a great job, man. I don't know where... I don't know where Torrent went. I need him, though. No, 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 please. Get up, get up. No! Oh, okay. That was Mimic, oh god. Yes! Woo! Woo! Yes! Oh my god. First try back. Oh, that was such great RNG. I need to do a happy dance, hold on. Fancy spin. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is it. It's happened. My roots are over there, but they don't matter much. Touch fractured Marika. Mend the Elden Ring.
the fallen leaves tell a story of how a tarnished became Elden Lord. In our home, across the fog, the lands between. Our seed will look back upon us and recall an age of fracture. I I was expecting something to come up with Ronnie because I'm pretty sure I locked in her ending. That seemed pretty generic. I don't know if it's like a post credit thing, but oh my god. I fucking did it. Uh, did, no, no Ronnie cutscene? Or is it like after credits? Or... I mean, there was a Marco thing there. Press triangle on it. What? Oh, that's, uh, that's Radon's music. Might actually still be able to go back to the other one, but yeah, it doesn't actually give you anything. It's just support cutscenes, it just, and it's an achievement. I wanted to see it. Yeah, so if you can't do it, you at least go watch the like perfect like, cutscene that I get you. Ah, oh, but just like I, the RNG was just so much better with the Elden Beast fight. Well, I, just so. The, like, the biggest thing was Mimic Tear lasted so much longer, and so both of the times he did the ring attack, he targeted oh, okay. Mimic Tear, and then he, like, didn't even do the Sword Swing follow-up. He kept doing the Magic Clouds instead. I keep forgetting. Yeah. Apparently it was very, very minimal. So, yeah, he like... himself, like, I hardly <laughs> Who's the fucking 3D artist, man? No, there's no final anything, so you can just leave this. Mm. Yeah, I'm curious actually if you can go choose a different Because you might be able to. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Oh, yeah. Say no to that. Say no to this. That's starting. Yes. Okay. At some point. Yeah, if you said yes to that, you're fucked. You'd have to do a whole other file. Yeah. Okay. So now so... you can go back because there is a grace in the tree. It's kind of weird. It's... Oh no, yeah. Because I don't think Yeah, now you're stuck. That's the only thing you get. Well, like I said, it doesn't actually give you anything. You just miss out, miss out on achievement and seeing a cutscene. So you can go look up the cutscene. I mean, I did all the work yeah. to do it. Oh my god. Yeah, it, it's a, it, it would have made a noise as it showed up. So, other than that, though, um, unless you just saw it, there's nothing that would have really... Like, what's the point in a freaking Sight of Grace in there, though, if it blocks me from... So that you can leave and come back to your ending. Oh, your, your runes just get put here. That's okay. So, yeah, can you... Like I said, it doesn't actually do anything. Also, you have 500k. Yeah, I, I did think it was weird when it showed the tree was repaired, and I'm like, oh, no. Yeah, so unfortunately, you're fine. They, I, I would say they should have made that more obvious, but, like, I'm not... It, it's not the right developer to do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, but yeah, and also it's like, it does make a noise and it shows up on the floor is blue, but yeah, unless you were like, listening for it and happened to turn, because it's not like directly in front of you, I think it's kind of to the side. 
So it's not like they hide it, but yeah, it's not entirely. I have how many can I do? Three? Okay. So maybe like one hit, two health? I'm gonna do a mind. Already got 50 bigger. You'll get a lot of rooms in the DLC and the Shadow Fragments are back. But I would get to 60 bigger because 60's kind of the uh, soft cap for both stats. Uh, after that, you start getting kind of like nothing. Is there a level cap? Or like, does it so just let you go to. 99 all stats. Okay. Whatever that ends up being. I think there's 12 stats, right? It's like 12 times 99. Yeah. Um, but there's soft caps in these games where, like, once yeah, you upgrade yeah. a stat, yeah, you just don't get much out of it. Like, if you upgrade a bigger now, you'd probably get, like, 12 HP, maybe more. Uh, where I'm at, it's giving me 6 HP. And I think eventually <sighs> it gets a bit better, and it's really only after, like, 80, where it's just really just, like, 2 HP and just basically nothing out of the stats. The exceptions for that are where scaling comes in. So if you have like S, if you somehow had a weapon that had like, you know, S in multiple stats, you could basically forever level up those stats. But usually you only get S in one stat, and once you have the strength past like 80, there's really not whatever the stat is. There's really not a whole lot. I don't have the defeated gesture, so it's for us. Because I, it was a big part of it that I wanted to do, do the Ronnie cutscene and get that. I should have looked around some more. I rushed into it. That's fine. You're excited. And like I said, this really cool. like the only thing you actually miss out on is the fucking or the yeah, yeah the cutscene and the achievements. So. It's not like you get the night. I put in all the work for it. And what is you doing that? Increasing you on that healing for your Estus? Yeah, and I I really don't think it was doing very much. I was trying there's, to get something because, like, a third of my health is... There's a better version in the DLC that is noticeable. Yeah, the base version. Is. For the FP, okay. it's a little bit different just because of how little FP you actually get per mind stat. That having your flask always replenish that is kind of nice. What because the... Because once you get to a lot of mind, it really doesn't... I can't change equipment oh, while I'm doing a gesture? Yeah, certain gestures can lock you out of a bunch of stuff. Okay. That's weird. Okay. Yeah, I would, um... Well, I guess I'm gonna do, do back to Arsenal, or do this thing. Um, no, yeah. that thing's pretty useless until the plus two version. There's three versions of it. It would be tier zero. Probably. So I would... I would do... Uh, I mean, 50 health, 9 stamina, and then, like... You could get the better version of this pretty... Oh, that is the plus... Wait. That is the plus one. Where'd you get that, dude? I tried to stack the uh, icon shield in this, and I don't think it was noticeable. Yeah, it's really not go... a lot. If you stack it without a whole lot of health, though, it's definitely noticeable. But it, it's mm -hmm. any regen you get is kind of nice because it can make the difference in literally like getting a long where we can save death potentially. Mm -hmm. But that's negative. Like it's 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 rare though. So yeah, as far as what stats you actually want or what talismans you actually want, uh, I'm not entirely sure. But um, yeah, I would not recommend. And also, the holy resist won't be useful now. Doesn't this do something other than what it says? No, it's just damage on uh, sorcerers. Okay. Could do that. Could do. Shorten spell casting time. I could just put back on the thing oh, I had oh, before yeah, yeah, it went. That, that ritual. The ritual, uh, both that and the sword version are both very good. Yeah, that, that's what I had before I switched to this. I'll give you like 50% damage reduction for the first time, so that's pretty damn nice. There's also a ritual sword version, actually, where it is if you want, which just gives you a lot more damage. Um, you're, you're hit as long as you're below HP, which is very nice, because if you don't get hit and get a few attacks off, that starts adding up to crazy numbers. Mm. It's like... I'm pretty sure I'll get it'll hit. It'll give you like... It'll give you like... 200 AR, depending on how late the game you are and what weapons you are. Where's the talisman that gives us two more talisman slots? No, also, I'm like mostly the DLC and said I'm the talisman slot. So I don't think they're giving me What no. did it Empty like, space right there. Right I have there. like two. No, I think three major bosses left. What uh, else can I have? Maybe two. I might literally only have two like cool bosses left. I am pretty damn close here. Mm hmm. 
putting the staff back. Also the boss, a lot of the community and Ski have been like, I killed Perch Drum. I had one Estus left and the rest of them. I'm pretty okay. I have like 16 stacks of the Shadow Fragment. It only goes up to 20 stacks. So I just literally taking like half damage to do a double. So I'm a little OP at this point, but yeah, I killed him. Why am I in heavy load with this? Oh, you probably need Arsenal. I need Arsenal. Here, easy, easy. Do it here. No, no, don't change that. This is practically nothing anyway. Just change that to the Arsenal. And that way you're getting something else. Yep. Or actually check. Will that will that put you over the this one? Okay, just do that for now. And then Back to basically what I had. You'll get talismans. You also go look at a list of them. If you want to do some like DLC prep and look up like all the items you need another or something. I do have base 38 intelligence now because I've been a bit, so. I do want to wear this for fashion. For twice the fluffy. Gabriel Iglesias said shit. Alright, well, yeah. Uh, go to mode. I kind of want to, you know, I, at, at least at first, I kind of want to do the DLC blind, like without mm -hmm. advice and stuff. Oh no, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't quite get the ending I wanted, but this is still first FromSoft or Souls-like that I've ever stuck with and gotten all the way through the end. It's the biggest one. It's a big deal.